Hey everybody, Adam from Newmark here. Uh, I just pulled my Newmark DJ2Go controller out of the package and I've got the included software disk for uh, Virtual DJ LE. We're going to go ahead and get that installed on my MacBook Pro right now. Uh, so I've got the CD disk, popped it in the CD drive. And there you see the icon of the disk labeled DJ2Go in the upper right hand corner. Uh, we're going to open up that disk. You have a few folders here. Obviously, we're on a Mac, our MacBook Pro here, so Mac folder. And you'll see the installer file right there. We're going to double click. You'll have the welcome to the installer, continue, license agreement, peruse if you wish. Click continue to continue. We will agree. Uh, and then proceed with the install. And the installation was successful. Hit the close button. We can close these windows uh, and even eject our disk. All right, once we're ready to go, uh, we can go ahead and open up our finder window, navigate to our applications folder, and we'll see Virtual DJ LE right there. Once launched, it'll ask for the serial number. You want to look on the back side of the CD sleeve that you pulled the disk out of, and there will be an authorization code for the software. We're going to go ahead and type that in. And once put in, click the OK button, and we'll launch our Virtual DJ software. And there we have our Virtual DJ LE. I'm going to go ahead and connect the USB cable to my DJ to go controller. Showing some life there, a couple of the buttons lit up. And uh, as you can see, we have tactile functionality uh, using the controller in our Virtual DJ LE. Now we're ready to start DJing. Thanks very much, everybody.